Alchemist. Multiple casualties. The alien, it's gone. Need immediate assistance. Do you copy? Nothing heard. Does anybody copy? Redwell, it's Dylan. You gotta get back to Crescent. Shit's kicking off here, man. <laughs> yeah? It's kicked off here, too, man. Get the Major! Trust me on this one. RT fucking B. Talk to me, Dill. What's going on? It's Jack. He's got explosives. All the Krovacs off our demining drones. Son of a bitch. He says he's gonna blow up the camp if the LDF don't disarm. All right. We gotta calm him the fuck down. I'm halfway there. Ah, shit, man. The dogs pulled his pistol on Jack. Baker and Lane are arguing with the Bluebells about, about whether ET's hostile. Hostile? Defensive, not hostile. We fired first. Don't let anyone there do anything stupid. Dylan! Dylan! Situation! Situation? Everybody's shooting one another! LDF Hightails! Fuck! Fuck! They're gonna be coming right at you! What? Keep a low profile, they're running for it! Did we just go to war with Livonia? No! Well, I mean, yeah, yeah, some of us did! They were gonna call a damn artillery strike on it, Rudd. Someone had to do something. Yeah? Like what? This? This? You fucked us, Jack! 
No, no. We fucked ourselves. You'd rather I let the LDF spark an intergalactic war? I did what I did. You don't have to be happy about it. And the Don? Uh, yeah, he took a shot at me and... I don't know. I, I don't know. It didn't end well. He's all over the fucking place if you catch my drift. Bad juju. Look, come on, we gotta move. Now. Before this fog lifts. All right, Jack, so this is the least discreet place to set up camp. You got any more bright ideas? Yeah, you know what, Rudd? I just might. Oh, hold on. You giving a briefing? That what this is? Nope. I'm putting Kesson in charge. What? Huh. <laughs> That's the smartest thing I've heard you say all night. I'm no in charge, Lutz. Okay, look. I got some shit to say. The Livonian Defense Force are gonna be hunting for us. Obviously. They believe we just went renegade. And there's a good chance Uncle Sam believes that, too. Yeah, no, I know, we did go renegade, but what's happening here? It ain't about the color of a flag. The aliens aren't attacking, right? And if we piss them off, it may all end really bad for us. I'm inclined to agree. As am I. Somehow, these fellas have survived themselves. That suggests intelligence, cooperation. It's possible they're acting in our best interests. Exactly. And the first thing we gotta do is figure out what's going on and what they want. Rudd, you reckon they were trying to commune with you? Mm, no. All I said was I saw something and felt, I don't know, off. You had a vision? Like the worst case of deja vu you can imagine. Great. Then you're our middleman. As for Kingsley and the rest of Sapphire, they're in the field. Dodging LDF patrols and looking for a way to reestablish comms. I said we'd assist by getting intel. Now, Private Lane here has already climbed the tower and had a look-see. One of them boomers was doing something in the valley, northeast of our position. And you want me to go see what the deal is? Actually, I was gonna ask Baker, but sure, if you're so keen. There's a hemet to the southeast, too. Could be worth the pass. We're low on gear. Okay. Steal stuff? Get abducted? <laughs> Am I missing something? Signals. You got two antennas. Keep an eye out for activity. Got it. Catch on the flip side. Listen up. I see a signal notification on that Omni antenna you gave me. You got any idea what that's about? Over. Oh, yeah. You're getting alerts on EM activity. Check the spectrum device. All right, copy. Thanks for the extra info. Out.
All right, Stipe. Definitely no alien here. Though there is a route, and... shit. It's not like the others. Can you clarify that a little, Rudd? It's been torn from the ground, not dug up like before. Nothing human could have done this. Over. Huh, okay. Hang on a tick. Dr. Kesson's saying we need another mini UGV. Over. Yeah? Sure, no worries. I'll just nip down to the local E Mart and get one for him, shall I? Gee, would you? That'd be a massive help. Failing that, there's an Astrovan. It's got eddies, and our scientists reckon they might have been insulated from that H pulse thing. They're on rubber tracks in a metal container, you see? Over. Perfect. So where is it? Shopka 41. That big old radar site on the ridge. And before you throw a hissy fit, I know, the LDF are there. But do what you did at the factory. Sneak in. Use the device to avoid any patrol, get the robot, and get out again. Over. I got family, Jack. Why is it so important? Two reasons. One, science and shit. Two, nine billion people might be coming down with a real bad case of space root flu next week. The poker probe on the mini UGV can get us a tissue there. Let us know if we should worry. Over. Whoa, back up there. You saying we gotta get a spit swap from it? Yep, using Eddie's scabbard. I don't know, maybe we can make a night of it or something. Out. Jack, it's me. I'm getting closer. Over. Okay, listen. Those LDF fuckers had a lot of drones up there, and Faraday cages to store them in. Meaning there's a good chance their autonomous weapon systems are set up already. But that funky fresh device of yours, it might help even the odds. If you can't find a way in, try and make one. Over. Yeah, solid copy. The shit I do for robots, huh? Out.
Jack. The van, where is it? Over. In the radar base, over. I'm in the radar base, be specific. I don't know, maybe in the middle of it? It's a white van with Astra written on it. Out. Okay, a white van. the robot and half the LDF ah! on my ass. Over. Okay, okay, great job. Get the hell out of there. Exfil. 